film some long ass intro and I wasn't even filming. Well done, I hope. Someone needs to give me tips on how to do my makeup quick because 364 might have gone through three, three batteries. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. How you all doing? I know it's been a long time. I'm back. I've not really been filming this summer because I'm on three holidays and I moved back home. I just didn't have the time. I was like moving, stressing over that, packing, stressing over that. I just said to myself, do you know what? I will start doing videos again once I've settled into uni. And I'm in my third year as well, so it's been quite like, uh, I'm actually gonna try. That's my goal for the end of 2018, to actually post a video once a week. Fingers crossed, I'm actually gonna try. I just came up with this, you know, makeup look. I was like, mm, feeling the brown hair, I wanna do brown eyeshadow and a bit of gold, gold jewelry. So yeah, nice and cute. And if you like to see how I achieve this look, then keep on watching. Highlights should pop in, girl, you know what I'm saying? Because that's all we do on this channel. First of all, I'm going to take the Nivea. Nivea Soft. This is my favorite moisturizer ever. I'm gonna go in with the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Concealer C12.5 underneath, and then I'm gonna use C14 on the top of my eyebrows. They don't look the same, but you know what? I'm just. I can't come and kill myself for eyebrows. Do you know what I mean? Max Select Cover Up Concealer in NC35, which is a very light shade. Oh, I'm gonna be using two palettes today and using the Makeup Revolution Reloaded palette. Anastasia Beverly Hills, looks a bit dirty. It's a glam. First colour I'm gonna go in is this like orangey shade right here. I'm gonna literally just go in straight. You're just gonna dab 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 dab. And this is gonna be like a transition colour. Now switching over to the ABH palette. This two shades right here. Extending that colour upwards, if that makes sense. We're just gonna take it higher. I thought I was recording then, but anyway, I've just gone in with the shade Sienna and Rustic, which are these two colours here. I've put them on that same transition, but not as high as the other two shades. Just gonna blend. We're gonna go in again with that old shade, Orange Slow Down, Burn Orange. And we're just gonna make sure that you can still see it above. Sometimes it looks like it's overpowering it. The shade that we are taking is the shade in the corner here. And it's called Mulberry and it's like a burgundy kind of shade. And we're literally just gonna deepen that crease. Clean brush to just make sure everything is nice and blended together. To so that concealer that we had in the beginning, let's do the crease. Oh yeah, we're doing a half cut crease, so we're not taking it to the very end. I always find it as well that we're doing the crease, it's best when you do a little dab pull, if that makes sense. This one's of you and I. 
Now for the lid colors, I'm gonna go with the shade Fairy and then I'm gonna go with the shade Bronze. Go with Fairy. Closing that cut crease. Them two shades. And I'm going back with that more gray. And now we're going to Cypress Umber, which is this dark brown, really dark brown. I was going to use black, but I don't want to make it too hard. Morphe M5, and I'm literally just going to tap, tap, tap. Shake all the X's. Um, I think with this shade, less is more because it's such a dark brown. I'm going with the Rimmel London Wonder Swipe and it's like an eyeliner slash eyeshadow that you can smudge out. I'm not going to smudge it out, I'm just going to do a little line. Going with the Makeup Revolution eyeliner, which is five pounds, and I actually love this eyeliner. It's so sick. So take these lashes from AliExpress. I absolutely love this. You literally get three pairs for one seventy, I think. And look how fluffy they are. So we're gonna go with the PS Insta Girl hashtag no filter and it's from Primark. And it's just this little oil. I'm gonna mix two of my favorite foundations together. Black Radiance Color Perfect Foundation and this is in the shade Brownie. Mix it a bit with the Maybelline Fit Me 365, which is quite dark. <laughs> Going with the nice concealers, but I'm gonna leave going with caramel. Quickly take my Fenty Beauty in Espresso. the Sasha Buttercup powder and I'm not really gonna bake I'm literally just gonna set it on my skin and blend it out Girl Queen Bronzer. I'm gonna set that contour. I'm gonna take Mac Give Me Some. I've actually been running out of this for like years. It's my favorite thing ever to just. 
Play my whole face, you know what I'm saying? And then I'm gonna take that more brew. I'm gonna put some mascara. That's the eyes done. I'm just gonna put some mascara. Okay, so with highlighters, I think I'm just gonna go all out. You know what I'm saying? First of all, I'm gonna go with the. I think it's now, it was called Bahi, but I think now it's called Ayel. I mean, I will link it down in the description box. That's our first highlighter done. We're gonna use some setting spray and I'm gonna use the makeup revolution matte setting spray. Now now we're gonna go for some more highlighter. And I'm gonna use my Fenty Beauty Trophy Wine because um, you are walking trophy. I'm gonna go with a Makeup Revolution Lip Liner in Glory. I'm gonna go with MAC Lipstick in Honey Love. Nip and Fab in Biscuit. If you've watched till the end put my social media up in here my twitter my instagram my snapchat and my blog so i want to film my q a i want to film like a question and answer you know so you guys can get to know me but i might do like a little poll here should i do a question and answer let me know but yeah thank you so much for watching guys and i'll see you guys on my next video bye but yeah, I'm. S I love my lipsticks are all right, yeah. But glossy, glossy. Come on, fam. You can't tell me gloss win. Oh my days, why's my camera on red? <laughs>